do it. Just do it. I mean, you don't have to, but if you don't do it, you're just a corporate shill. Hear me, hear me out. PewDiePie is the last, he's the old guard of what YouTube was. He is an individual. Sure, he might have some help in the back end, but he is the old guard of what YouTube was all about. You. And now there's a corporation, a company about to take the number one seed. The gist of it is that a company ran channel that uploads, gosh darn, I don't know how many videos a day. I don't know how they do it. They must, they must just be those, those poor interns. I got to say those, those poor interns, nonstop titling tags and thumbnails, bless their heart. Yeah, but they're about to over, um, overpass PewDiePie and we, we can't, we can't, we can't have that happen and we have to delay it as long as it's going as long as possible. In the long run and through our actions, T-Series will probably still pass PewDiePie, but at least here over at the Flea Dolly community, we have contributed as much as possible. Do it, all right? Make YouTube about you. This whole thing's more of a joke thing, but if you do want to help, I'll, I'll link his channel down below. I don't know if you guys have ever heard of him. Um, it's kind of hard to spell, so link is in the description below. But guys, welcome back to the channel. Holy cow, Nato. Why, why has no one made a fuss about this to me? Why has no one brought this to my attention? This is an unloved episode. We have never given this thing love at all. We never even talked about. When we kill it, we don't mention it. When it's on our team, we don't even acknowledge it. Loving, un loving the unloved. Here we go. So the NATO, NATO, I'm going to call it NATO because I'm just probably pronounced like that. And you guys know what I mean. Battle rating 3.3 tank destroyer with an complete open top. If you get a aircraft going in maybe about 35, 45 degree angle, they're going to be able to douse all your crew. You do have a lot of crew making this thing somewhat survivable if they don't hit to the left or right of the vehicle. And if they do shoot here, most of the time the crew will eat up the rounds or eat up the shrapnel and the explosive before it gets to the rounds. Most of the time your engine's going to go. So the good thing is, whoa, sorry about that. If they hit the engine, they're not likely to hit the breach or if they hit the breach, they're not likely to hit the engine. So you do have some ability to uh, get out of there. Or if your engine's dead, you'll have the ability to fire. 5.9 second reload with a fully ace crew. Now, this gun, 75 millimeter at 3.3. Not, you know, the biggest deal in the world. You know, the Panzer 4F2, more maneuverable, more armor. The same reload, 5.9, 5.9. What makes this gun so special? Well, we can start off with the ammunition. Decent pen. Really good pen. Probably not going to use this round at all at 3.3. That's completely overkill. We might bring one, but I don't know in what situation we would have to use it. Where it becomes prevalent is its velocity. Its muzzle velocity is 830. Compared that to the Panzer 4F2's explosive round, 740. Then we go back to the Japanese tank. So easier to aim gun, higher velocity, and then the explosive mass. The TNT equivalent is unreal for a 75 millimeter shell at 3.3. 67.8. We'll just round that up to 68 grams of TNT. Only 29. So just imagine that how easy it is to kill by one-shotting tanks in the Panzer IV F2. And now with two and a half more times, that's roughly, of explosive mass, there's no way you cannot one shot if you hit center of mass. This thing is going to ruin, ruin enemy tanks. Now the armor, on the other hand, is really nothing. But this is War Thunder. And no armor is better than having sufficient armor. Rounds might just overpen us. But again, to reiterate, once the plane gets up, we're pretty much done. So we got to pick a good spot with tree cover, shadows, anything just to hide us as long as possible from those aircrafts. Okay, without further ado, guys, 3.3, not to. Huh, usually I would say it's nice to play a Japanese tank because normally you're with the, uh, well, the friends of the Japanese. But I'm reversing them. We are going to be versing the Germans and the Russians. No problem. Just need to get to a nice early game position. 
little difficult though in this vehicle not the fastest but still we're, we are able to get there it's just it's not as comfortable as i would like it to be okay tank spot it you might have seen me too high velocity cannon this is the shot oh god vt7 that is kind of ridiculous now one thing i didn't mention is that the nato is really good because it can have a I would shoot there. Oh, Lord. Stug's dead. That's what just happened right there was really scary. That that kind of... Oof. Well, just, just my luck. <laughs> oh, my God. As I... What I was going to say is that uh, the high silhouette makes this thing great for, you know... Engaging from positions that not every tank can. You might have an enemy tank trying to push this Chihi, and he does. Okay. Well, no, he's gone now. That's a scenery Panzer three. This darn tree's in my way, and I might have to get rid of it. Okay, T-34. Hold the shot. Look at that. It's so... It's such a quick round. For 3.3. Might have an enemy tank over here to the right. Yeah, we do. T-50. He went down to the cover. Just making sure we clear our left here. He's going to be popping out soon, right? There's his tracks, right? Let me tank close. Come on, come on, come on. Fast, fast, fast. Depression. Unbelievable. 3.3. Now, I just heard a shot over to my right. Whoa. We've got flankers. I'm gonna go check it out. And then we, and we probably are gonna relocate. But just how little tanks we've seen already. I feel like there's a much bigger push from behind us. Well, we're gonna we're gonna have to be careful in our shots now. We need every shot to be a potential one shot, just because look how many players are left. And look how much ammo. Ne next game, I'm, I'm gonna bring full ammo. Oh yeah, I can hear him. Right out in the open. This is no bueno. Fudge. Don't look at me. Go, Tank. Go. Nice. Thank you, Chinu. Oh, this is my American brethren. Oh, my. That was like four freaking tanks right there. You ready to fire? German. Hold fire. Might have a Puma looking at us. No! Unbelievable. We're going to try to get into their forest line here. 
And with this, we'll hopefully stay away from the planes incoming soon. No, God. You missed your bomb. You missed your bomb. Oh my God, that was a big bomb. How didn't that kill the 87? Come on, plane, plane, help. He's gonna machine gun me down now. Stay alive, buddy. Oh, God. Gosh, you would really think, think about it. Like, they could just extend this with maybe, you know, four more tracks and then put an anti-air on the back. Hmm, that should have been really close. T-34 over here. Suka. They might be trying to push this way. We're going to take a defensive position. At the same time, we have a Crusader over here as well. Tank left. There's the... Uh Not the best hit at all. T-34 still doesn't know what's going on. I don't, I don't think they can see me holding. Oh, oh, wow. That, that's, that's one shot material right there, War Thunder. It's because his darn fuel tanks blocked it. I, uh, I, 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 I love this thing. I don't know wh why. Why has there been no love given to this? Oh, I think he just reversed. Trees, trees are the worst. <sighs> Go away, tree. You gotta blow it away. There we go. Wow. Just wow. Now I see ya. Got a KV-1 to our left. I'm gonna try to be sneaky and kind of uh, get into their sniping position and then just shoot them from behind as they pass me. That, that's the goal. And enemy aircraft are here and well. There's the KV-1 to our left. He's not happy. Just gonna delay engaging him as long as possible. Yeah, we have extremely good control over Alpha and Bravo right now. Might be able to... Okay, hold fire. Okay, good. Really good positioning. Yeah, I think majority of their team is just going to be at Charlie and trying to push back into Alpha and Bravo, which they're going to get just picked off one by one. They're only... They're only, like, real way of getting in is at Charlie, which you... Well, you can't win the game by just having Charlie. Okay, what we have here, we have an M10 pushing in. KV-1 still to our left. No need to engage him yet, though. Another tank to our right as well. Interesting. I really shouldn't do this. I just want to get this KV-1 out of here. Oh, it's not a... Oh, yeah, it is a KV-1. Okay. Pass the pen. And it does. And it makes one hell of an explosion. M24 to our right. 
He's dead. Here comes the M3. I'm going back into cover. Now, let's check the Charlie area out. Okay, Valentine to our right. Depression. Perfect. Tank fart. Just, just erroneous. Tank to the left. Okay, I, I can see him. Hold. It was a T-34. He's dead, though. To our right, we got a Sherman. T-34 in front. Fart. High chance of dying by aircraft. What are you doing, Tank? You're just rolling so good. You're just rolling so good here a second ago. Now there is a, an extremely high chance of us dying by aircraft here, but I'm I'm, I'm more than satisfied. But this thing's play already. <laughs> it's just, it's just absolutely ridiculous. Interesting. Oh gosh. You see this guy? What a what a sneaky tank. That turret is so small for what the gun it packs behind. That makes sense. Like you can, you're able to creep that thing up so nicely. No A push though. I mean, when a lot of your team's dying at Charlie and Bravo, it's probably, you know, maybe a... I hear something near me. A good college tried to um, go to A. Okay, engine shot on the anti-air. For a hold break. There we go. I don't really think I shot there, but okay. We, uh, we killed both crew members. <laughs> Did I really shoot at the crew compartment? I thought I shot at the engine. Okay, enemy at A. How long is he gonna last? I don't know, but at least they're adaptive. Eh, I don't even know what's there. We're gonna get this tree out of the way first. T-34 at Alpha. Oh, he's right there. Let's dip this round. Not enough. Too much velocity on the gun. If we back up to the right a little bit, we might be able to get him. Oh, let's go forward. How did my driver... Oh, he hit lower glacis. Is that a Churchill? Go, 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 go. Nice. Beautiful. Okay, we're operational. I think I took a shot from A. No, he's dead. What? There's... I felt like I shot... Oh, it's probably the plane. Okay, now, let's move. Oh, he's too fast. Here's a shadow though, right? Is he, is, is he trying to locate me? Good. Miss approach. Yeah, shadows. Dude, planes hate shadows. Fellas, I truly hope you enjoyed this video. The amount of killing was so satisfied, so satisfying with the Nato. I I really feel sorry for this vehicle with how much love it just gave us and how little we have given it since now. These things these things could easily play. I'm not even going to suggest anything. I'm not, okay? 3.3, enjoy it. Fellas, have a great day. Until next time, peace out.